Greetings and welcome back to Factorio. I'm Catherine of Sky, and in the last episode, we started a major to do list because we need stuff to do. So, uh, first of all, we want to get power organized. So, let's go back into shopping speed. And we're going to get just more belts from here to add to our, um, our place because we need them like crazy. We definitely need these things to come online. Um, yeah, we don't have any of that happening. Okay, gonna need to pick up some more belts as it happens as well. See, no, 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 no. All right, I gotta go get more belts. Ran out. And life is not good without no, any belts or insufficient belts, I should say. Because we do have some in the factory. They're just not at my personal location. 900 might be too much. But it might not be. I forgot to put the uh, things in the train, the, the oil pump jacks. So that's not good. Um, we left the train at Green Circuits, but we'll be back there shortly. I have, yeah, I have space in my inventory. That's good. I kind of wish inventory management really wasn't a thing in this game. Okay, let's take this down this way. There we go. Now with this... I think what I want to do is something like this. There we go. Um, I think we need a three to two splitter in here or, or balancer type of thing. I think that's what we really need. Because at the moment, this is really not what we want to do. I think we don't know. We definitely don't want to do this. We want to do something else. Let me just completely delete this whole thing here. All right, balancers. And it's really not balancing so much that I'm doing at the moment. It is more like um, prioritizing lanes. There we go. That's what we want. Oh, and I can't drop it anywhere. Uh, all right, we'll just put it in there for now. Okay. We're really out of <laughs> red splitters. Oh my god. That's embarrassing. Caught without red splitters. Oh no. Oh, this is really uh, drying up too. Gonna have to build a train station to get iron in. You know what? Let's add that to the to-do list. Um, add new. Add train stations at base for copper and iron plates. Save. We're not gonna bother assigning these to ourselves because um, that would seem to look weird. Uh, it would imply that I had other people and I don't have anybody else helping at the moment. Okay, let's go and put this coal and stuff in the chests. Though I could take the coal out, actually, and just feed it to our happy little furnaces. I have to say, this has been kind of an interesting challenge-ish. I don't know if it's been a challenge, but it's been an interesting factory. And I say that because right now I feel like I'm very much lacking in production, but that's because we've been limiting ourselves on purpose to using the factories. And I'm wondering if that's the best idea or not. Uh, it probably isn't. Okay, here we go. We can get these. Oh, that's right. That's why we had um, slow belts is because these guys don't pick up very well from fast belts. You can see them kind of like uncertain confused like oh 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 it's going too fast can i grab it yeah i wish these guys would work a little bit better with faster belts um but anyway things are filling up it's going okay uh and we now have power again um what was i talking about i can't even remember <laughs> oh dear um <laughs> oh yes we were looking at these guys yeah that's right i feel like we're quite limited in many ways by using this mod and, and kind of making rules for ourselves with the mod as well. Uh, mainly that we decided, yes, we're going to mainly use 
the big factory buildings instead of using smaller buildings. And I feel like it's kind of hindered us in many ways. So let's see. Is there any of these guys not running? No, they're all running. That's good. Okay, let's just reverse this belt for now. And we'll just shuffle that iron along. But otherwise, yeah, we're having a bit of a time here. They're just not getting much ore at all. Uh, so we're going to run out of iron soon if we don't get the train station in. Let's look at our list again. Um, let's, okay, we've done this one. <sighs> build stuff. We need to build stuff. I think I, I really want to get those centrifuges going, at least. I think I want to plop the the mall again here. But I don't remember where the centrifuges are made. I think they might be here, maybe. Or possibly where we cannot put them. So I might just get a different um, setup for them. Let's see, centrifuges require steel. Ah, they need concrete. I don't think I have a concrete assembler. Unless it's this one. This might make concrete. Mm, maybe. All right. Let's just plop the mall thing again on top of it. I want to go with the early game mall. Let's see what we got here. Belt array. Here we go. There we go. Oh, and anyone who finds mistakes in the mall, please don't worry about them. I'm going to redesign the entire mall when we get to 0 0.17. Oh, these are walls. We don't even need walls. No, 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 go away. No, no, stop. Stop thing. We don't need this. Don't need it at all. Mm-hmm. And I wish I had my train. Okay, that's all right, though. Yeah, don't don't worry about them all. Um, it is functional right now, but if, if you find tiny mistakes, don't worry about them because it's really not... I don't really care about them because I'm going to redesign them all. Okay, I want to put them... I need to put some junk in here. Man, landfill bricks. <sighs> Thinking how I might add centrifuges to this whole thing... We definitely do not need gates, and that's probably something I'm going to take out of the mall um, at that at some point because I rarely, rarely ever pay, play with biters any longer because I just find them boring. I just find combat in this game not a fun idea. I just love to do the factory. I just don't care about biters. It's not that I find combat generally boring because I do play games with combat, and it's just like I don't want to play it in this game. Uh, okay, now then, we need an assembler to make concrete. Wait, oh, I did the wrong thing there. I need my building train. <sighs> All right, I want you to make concrete, I think. And water is probably going to come from the left. And then we can make a an assembler for, I think we have almost everything here for a centrifuge. Maybe. Closely. Yeah, we have everything except for red circuits. Which we do have. Nice. We have all the things. Nice. We have all the things. Alternatively, here, I could do a loader. Fast mini loader. One, two, three, four. No, there's not enough spaces to put a chest in between. I could do this, though. I could just do this and that and have an inserter put into the chest. Like this. I want to have a chest here. Yeah, I think that would work fairly well. This goes out of the chest. And this one goes into that. That makes, yeah, that works. I think that's going to work better. Or well enough, anyway. There we are. Do we have any water coming in here? I don't think so. Alright, let's just go get the water. Okay. 
Okay. Okay, we are close. All right, let's go ahead and put down our offshore pump. There we go. Yay. And we can make concrete. All right, we've got stuff going on. We need more labs, I think. Let me go and pick up some more labs. I was lamenting that we only could have 10 at a time here. Let's just go pick those guys up. Place them down. There we go. <laughs> you know what? Labs don't work very well if there's no inserters either. <laughs> I just realized this. <laughs> and if you mentioned that um, a few episodes ago, I apologize. I've been uh, uh, recording several episodes in the same day, so I haven't seen your comment yet. But don't worry. Never fear. KOS always finds it <clears throat> eventually. It's all good. There we go. Research. I think the the thing is, it's like, you know, I, I was like, okay, we're just plopping these down. It'll be fine. Um, but then I don't actually watch to see if they're, uh, if they're doing stuff. Do we have any more? We need more productivity modules though for here too. See, that's the real issue. It was, it wasn't this at all. It was the, uh, it was the inserters. <laughs> I'm highly amused by this. It's okay though. We get to derp a little bit plan. I'm going to put these speed modules in here. I don't really need this many stacks. And I don't need this. I'm just trying to clear out the inventory a little bit. Delete. Okay, good. Uh, oh, yes. I need... I don't need these. I think we're okay on those guys. So I'm going to... You know what? I'm just going to put these back. Because we're not going to need efficiency for anything else, really. Productivity, yes, we will need those. So I'll take one stack of those. Ooh, do I only have two of those? Yeah, let's get one more thing of those. All right. Just so we have some modules on us. So we can do stuff. Okay. These guys have no modules. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Excellent. A little bit short. We still need more labs, but uh, hopefully the uh, research is going to go a little bit faster. Maybe. Of course, then we probably won't be able to keep up with it, but that's another story entirely. All right. So we've been doing so many things that I've kind of forgotten what we're supposed to do. We need to build centrifuges. Ah, that's what we were on. Okay. Okay. Make sure that this is working. Hello. Ah, right. We need a one of those to grab those guys. Oh, we need ore for this. Oh dear. Hmm. All right, spaghetti time. It'll be fine. I need ore. So I think I would really like to cut off all this stuff. Is there any actually? Is there any ore closer to there? No tiny little patches just hiding out here. Uh huh. No. Apparently not. Uh, we still have 668,000 plus 37k um, that are going into here. But ideally, I'd like to chop all this off. In fact, maybe I will do this. Maybe I'll just take this belt and bring it along. We just needed to go to here, like up here. Take this up this way. We could put it next to the steel belt for now. Okay. Rotate this. All right. And this, yes, we decided that that wasn't going to work very well. Oh, the spaghetti is real. All this will be fixed one day. That is for sure. Perfect. Okay, this works. Um, and then that one will be just cut off from the production. 
I think the others can supply it. So I think it'll be okay, generally. Uh, and we have this um, balancer to make sure that we, we're getting some stuff here. All right, so let's just connect this up. Okay, we need to get rid of this. All right, and inserter. Do I need a stack inserter? How much iron does it need? Just one. All right, I'll just put a fast one. Could even do with a regular inserter. Should be fine. Oh, and here we go. We already have the ore coming. Good. This is going to work. So this guy needs how much? A hundred concrete. So that's 10 cycles of this machine here. We do need gears. So we'll grab those from the side belt. All right. And we're doing something. <laughs> we're getting stuff done. All right. Let us put down one of these guys. And I think we want to just limit this to like 10 or one stack. I don't even remember how many are in a stack. Hmm. Should I speed module this guy? Kind of tempted to. It looks like it's going faster now. Yay. All right, now then. Okay, we need what? We didn't build the sulfur train yet. All right, so we have this, the centrifuges we built. Uh, did we add the sulfur train? I don't know. Let us check. We might have. We did. Right, there it is. Cool. And it's not, it has no red circuits because the red circuit train is still stuck up here, I believe. And it's still stuck up here because we have no, um, no plastic, no plastic, no. we have no oil, no petroleum. And the petroleum of course is down in our oil area or isn't down in our oil area as the case may be. Yep. Not enough. Insufficient stuffs. Okay. Time to get the oil. That is the most important thing on our to-do list. Um, I think, I'm not sure we are running out of copper or iron, I should say. So that's kind of not great, but we do need to get that oil moved along. Oopsies. Ah, you're not going to get me today. No, no. Okay. There's the green circuit or the train is going to be here. Our oil field is up here. See how we want to move this. Oh, copper tasting nice. Wow. That's a lot of copper. I think what I'll do is I'll just copy this kind of a thing. Do we have any uh, coal up there for feeding fuel? No, there's some here, but I think we'll be okay with this. All right. Just keep on going. And we need to go up. Oh, here. Yeah. We could build the station first. If we wanted to. I think I'll have the station to the north. Because these lakes are kind of blocking it. And then we'll just have this um, branch line coming off here. See how we want to do this. Oh, wow. I already have all the, the pump jacks down. Look at this. Wow. Past KOS uh, thought about making future KOS's life easier. How nice. <laughs> That's very thoughtful of her. Hello. <laughs> uh-huh. Okay. So now I want to get our loading stations. We want to grab this one. Uh, well, let's grab the refueling station and then a loading station. Here's refueling, which doesn't have, that's so stupid. I don't know why I did it that way. All right. Refueling station is here. Um, let's just grab this, call that good. Just take the whole thing, signals and all. Now, do I want the trains to sit like this? I could have them kind of go over the top and come downward. That might be okay. 
Uh, right. So we're going to have them. Oh, hold on. Yeah, yeah. That's how we want it to go. All right. These guys. I kind of like lost track of what I was doing. Okay. So I have to think upside down now. This is going to be interesting. Um, yeah, we can have these coming down. That's fine. And then this one is going to be from the opposite direction. So we'll delete all of this stuff here. Okay. That's the way we want it, I think. All right, place it. Okay, there we go. I think that will work quite nicely. And then get our fluid loading. Go to blueprint land. Get our train stations, rails, loading. There we go. We may even have more buffer tanks here. Okay, cool. That looks like it's working pretty darn well. Let's go into slower walking mode. Okay, cool. And these guys are going to connect. We'll have the parking above. We need another station. Hello. <laughs> oh, that was so cute. I don't know if you heard that. I said hello, and my minty went. Brrr. So, so cute. Okay, can I, it's now time for a cat patting break, by the way. Um, the cat has now leaped on my desk and is desirous of patting. Okay, now she's walked off. I hope you have uh, paused the video and taken time to pat your pet, um, whatever kind of pet you might have. Uh, hopefully it likes being pet and is not dangerous to pet like a scorpion. I would not advise petting it. Um, but you never can tell scorpions might need love too. So, okay. <laughs> this has been interesting. All right, let's make some of these. Oh, cat is back. Hello, my minky. Okay. Got to kiss the head. Head loves to be kissed or we're teaching it to love to be kissed. All right. My good minky. Good girl. She is such a happy critter. Yes, now you're putting your tail on my mouse. How nice. Okay, so we now have a fueling station. We're going to call this, um, I guess it's going to be oil too. Wow, we have a second station of some kind. Oil to refuel. And this is going to be oil too, or crude oil too, maybe. No, just oil too, I think, right? Yeah, oil to pick up. There we go. And of course, going to be black. All right, there we go. We have stuff, we have things connected. This, I want to connect to the main line through one of these guys. Let's get our rails out from here. And then we can do our rails from that point. Okay. Go straight, straight rails mostly. Okay, there we are. And the nanobots are going to get most of this stuff built happily while we're here, which is nice. As long as they have the tracks to do so, they remind me. Yes, I'm hearing nanobots in my sleep. Whoa. All right, radar is going to have to leave for now, but we'll put it back. Oh, and this power pole too. Got to go. Sorry. Interruption in the space time continuum. We apologize for any inconvenience. And that has to go. And I, yep. Okay, cool. Looking very, very good. Let's put down our radar once again, so we don't forget. And then connect up these bits here. And of course the power is needed as well. All right, let's go grab our train. There we go. I don't know how much in the way of uh, railroad pieces we have. Not many. Let's grab some from the train so that we can build as we go along. Nope, oh, not there, not there. Wait. All 
All right. Crab to the left. Let's go. There we are. We'll just fill in all these little gaps. And life will be better. And we will start producing some more oil. And hopefully fulfill our, um, our refinery's needs. We've been neglecting those needs for a while now. Okay. Let's move up this way. Nice. And then we need to get out our straight rails. There we are. Okay. Wires connect. That's good. Need to get power to this area as well. We got plenty of stuff. Oh, I forgot to buy some signals at the mall. Darn it. And <laughs> how ironic. <clears throat> yes, it's fine. <laughs> My building train ran out of fuel. That is probably the funniest thing ever. Okay, let's just give it some more handily available wood. Okay, mining productivity. We're running out of stuff to research. Uh, cargo size. Yeah, we'll take that. That sounds good. Oh, well, I forgot that this was right here. Okay. Um, yeah, it'll be, it'll be okay though. We don't really need a giant parking space for this area. Let's go there with this. I want to, let's go look at our parking. And I have to say this game has been one of the longest or most games with the most amount of outposts ever. Very early game. And normally, um, I don't know if I really like making that many outposts, but I guess it works. I usually save those for later, almost like end game times, but it's been interesting, that's for sure. Okay, let's get this found. And then rails in. All right, and we are at the edge of stuff. Good. Nice, very nice. Okay, so now we have parking coming in um, and stuff is here. Now let's connect this to the main power grid here. There we go. Lights are online. Perfect. Now then, I can't remember if we added, I guess we did add the sulfur stuff. So we need to get our fueling train. I think it's this one. Can I click on it from here? Come on train. I know that you want to be clicked. So just before green circuits. Okay. Let's add this thing that I have not named yet. I did add it. Oh my God. <laughs> there I, I kind of trolled myself. Okay. It's fine. Uh, all right, we need to add oil to refuel to our list. Um, time passed is fine. Good. Go there, please. All right, so this should refuel this. Now we just need to get all of this stuff hooked up. Worker cargo size is good. Um, advanced materials processing too. Sure, why not? Okay, we'll just connect up all these guys here. Now then, let's just rotate these to a more workable kind of configuration. Right there we are. Okay, so all of those are now connected. Wow, these are so thick in here. And that one can go this way.
There we go. Okay, so now all those are added. Let's just make these go downward and add these like in a little clump here. All right, nice. Now the thing I worry about is, is this enough for, to add to like a tank farm here? I think we'll add our tank farm. Let's do this. Let's just do that. So we want to have some amount of storage here. And we want to have uh, multiple entries into the storage. Okay, so these guys are going to come in from the opposite direction. Let's just remove these things real quick. All right, here we go. What do we need? We need all the things, of course. Um, breaking force, personal roboports. Why not? Don't know if we'll ever use them. I, I really love nanobots just because they are so incredibly efficient. I love them. Let's see, we want to get this going like this. Have another one going like that. Again, this to there, that to there. And, oh, this doesn't work quite the way I wanted it to. Hmm. It's a little bit annoying. I could do this though. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. That's fine. Just to make sure we have all the things that we want. Now I need more pumps. Um, one. Okay, make ten more. And we'll just put these pumps out here. Oh my gosh, I'm out of pipes. No. Say it ain't so. Okay, hold on. Building train is blocking the way. Inefficiencies existing. Oh no. I find that personal robots are really so slow. Oh, I mean, just any of the robots before you have space science. Space science is when you can really increase them through the infinite research. You can increase the speed quite a bit. Um, and I just think that it's it's really useless to have them at slow speed. It just doesn't make sense to me. Uh, maybe it's different for other people, but I just like, I don't get why they have to be slow. It doesn't feel like it's conducive to, to gameplay in that way. All right, I want to, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, careful, gently, gently. Okay, there's one output here. Now then, we need another output to be probably coming from this side, or maybe even like here. There we go. That cannot be there. No, no. Aha, there we go. That works. Now, I want these guys also. Let's put these guys toward the side as well so we can just get them where they need to go. Um, that one will connect right there, though. Let's just do this further down. Nice. All right. I just want to have all of this stuff coming from different uh, tanks, different areas. Of course, this may not work very well because I don't have pumps between the tanks. Maybe I should do that. Maybe I should just put them um, so they can kind of fill up in a specific pattern. Yeah, let's try that. Let's just do that. Just go like this and make more pumps, of course. <laughs> yeah, I think that will be okay if we do this, this this way. I know it looks very strange, but we're trying new things. It should be fine. There we go. 
That one works that way. Okay. All right, that is going to work that way. And then we can have a larger area of these tanks that are just not um, that way, like this way. This should be fine. We just want to pressurize these guys, make these have the most amount of stuff in them. Uh, and then we can take these things and then feed them into the sides here. So it doesn't backflow into the um, these other pipes that are taking all of this stuff. I think that makes sense. Um, well, at least it does right now. If it doesn't work, we can always change it. It's not an issue. Not at all. Okay, one, two, three. Good. Okay, that's going to help take that stuff. Um, now then, we need to add some of these guys back onto this line. That one's fine. Um, now then, I can take these guys. Kind of move them along this way. And I don't want to connect all the pipes together. I'm very specifically keeping some of them separate. And then these will go into another set of tanks and such. Because I think that makes some amount of sense. Possibly. I hope it does. We shall see. We want to not have restricted flow. This is a really nice oil field where we can take great advantage of having this many um, pump jacks and, and oil spots in the area. So we just want to keep that working quite nicely. Okay, so these guys are connected down here. I think I'll just bring a pipe over this way. Okay, and so this clump is connected then, and then we'll get these guys going. Uh-huh, okay. these no 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 I didn't want to do that no no there we go that's much better okay these are connected and they just need to be connected to these two and get a pump to flow into those tanks okay looking pretty darn good I'm I'm liking this. This is looking okay. All right. And soon we shall fill the whole area with oil. And everything will be perfect and nice and stuffs and things. Oh, I can't walk through there. Oh, I can walk through that way. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. I'm gonna try the lazy way of doing these power poles here. Okay, nice, nice. I don't know if I like the lazy way. I kind of prefer the more methodical way, in a way. It's not it's not that fun, but I feel like I get better coverage. All right, nothing is blinking. Yay. Okay, and these guys are doing pretty well okay so these are filling up with a little bit of crude but they're all getting really pushed into these guys yeah that's working pretty well i think okay next thing to research we'll get um uh, logistics slots works for me these guys are going and now we need to have a train putting this stuff into the proper refining station 
Do I have any more locomotives? That's a very good question. I don't see any. Oh dear. All right. I think um, that I will have to go get some. Is there? Are there any in the train? Hello. Train? Do you have any trains? No. All right. That I think is going to be an, a project for the next episode. Uh, because we have to go all the way back to the mall and all that kind of thing. We'll get all this thing set up and uh, should be running smoothly. Then we should get more red circuits. Yay. So anyway, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I'll see you next time.